Gaming Bolt presents 19 biggest Kickstarter games coming in 2016. We have a lot to talk about, so let us dive right in. Bloodstained Ritual of the Night It's become a trend now for developers of classic games who have left the companies that originally published those games to take to Kickstarter. Koji Igarashi, acclaimed director of several notable Castlevania games, is the latest to do so with Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. The game will revolve around Miriam, an orphan who is afflicted with an alchemist's curse. This curse is slowly turning her body into crystal, and this is where the majority of her abilities will stem from. Mighty Number no. 9 Mighty Number no. 9 was originally set to come out this year, but a heartbreaking delay means the spiritual successor to Mega Man has slipped into 2016. The gameplay is very reminiscent to that of the Blue Bomber, with an extra foil added for good measure. Ukulele a team of developers who worked on the classic N64 platformer is creating a new platformer duo for the new generation. Yuka is the sly-looking iguana, while Lele is her spunky bat sidekick. The two will work together to round up collectibles, roll over enemies, and jump around the colorful world. Kingdom Come Deliverance Fans of Skyrim and other massive open-world RPG adventures will find plenty to love in Kingdom Come Deliverance. While the game is set in the real world, meaning that it lacks the dragons and spells of other such games, the exhaustive attention to detail and its brutally intense combat make it. Hyper Light Drifter Some of the best games being released right now have a pixelated art style that is reminiscent of gaming's younger years. Hyper Light Drifter rides this trend with style. A top-down action game with a teleport mechanic baked in, the evocative pixel art brings the psychedelic sci-fi world to life. Star Citizen Take off into the stars, building your own ship and carving out your own path. In Star Citizen, you deck out your spacecraft and choose what you want to do with your time. You can wage war against other pilots, be more docile and become a traitor, or just explore the universe, building up your fleet and making your mark among the stars. We Happy Few In We Happy Few, you find yourself in a bizarre alternate 60s town, inhabited by drug-crazed psychopaths all sporting strange, grinning masks. You explore the town, collecting supplies to aid your survival, and piecing together the psychotic puzzle that the game places in front of you. Divinity Original Sin 2 The original Divinity Original Sin took Kickstarter by storm, and the follow-up quickly met its funding goal and is set to upstage its predecessor. With turn-based, dungeon-crawling RPG gameplay and a rich and diverse level editor, it is a love letter to classic RPGs and has a lot to love for fans of the genre. Cryomore a story-focused action RPG with expressive pixel art and a rich-looking world full of things to explore, Cryomore is full of places to discover, puzzles to crack, and a story to unfold. While some of the areas are a little tight, there are plenty of branching paths to uncover and enemies to conquer. Amplitude The series is back thanks to fan demand and a successful crowdfunding campaign. Amplitude will be immediately familiar to those who played the original. You guide your craft across three lanes, matching the rhythm and racing down the track. Everspace Everspace is a very unique title. You guide a spaceship through the trails of a roguelike gameplay system, progressing along a captivating, non-linear story. Progression holds over to each new life, so you slowly make your way through the galaxy, growing stronger with each battle. The Bard's Tale 4 The Bard's Tale 4 continues the series' rich legacy of deep combat and witty jokes. With fast-paced, turn-based combat and a large party of customizable characters to guide through maze-like dungeons, this title is sure to be a welcome respite from the serious and macabre games that sometimes plague the genre. Shantae – Half-Genie Hero The genie Shantae is no stranger to the gaming realm, and thanks to Kickstarter, she's coming back. A platformer with puzzles to solve, chasms to jump, and baddies to whip, the series is still firmly rooted in classic platforming gameplay, with new features designed to take advantage of new hardware. A Hat in Time The 3D platforming collectathon is making a triumphant return, and A Hat in Time led the charge when it was initially launched via Kickstarter. The game stars Hat Kid, as she runs and flips through the colorful world to collect hourglass-shaped fuel for her spaceship. Pathologic After a strange illness sweeps over a small mountain town, three healers set out to find a cure to save their home. They'll have to overcome an invisible evil in the massive open world while they scavenge for food and supplies to survive. However, surviving will be no easy task in Pathologic. Battle Chasers Night War 
a deliberately difficult JRPG whose inspirations lie firmly in the Final Fantasy series, Battle Chasers Night War is the newest game from Joe Madureira. He's best known for his work on the Darksider series. He and his studio are aiming to make a JRPG that will be very familiar to fans of the stoic genre. Toe Jam and Earl, back in the groove. The famous duo are coming back, and while we're not sure how to feel quite yet, we'll try to be optimistic. Sporting the same roguelike gameplay, bizarre enemies, and spastic animation, the game looks like it will be very familiar to fans of the original. Camelot Unchained In Camelot Unchained, you're free to mold the world as you see fit. You start by choosing one of the realms and decide how to proceed from there. Every building you raise or tower you crumble will send ripples across the land, changing how events transpire. Unsung Story while the project has hit a recent speed bump, it is still on track and will still see the light of day. While we'll have to wait and see if it can squeak into the loaded release calendar of 2016 with Yasumi Matsuno, a vagrant story in Final Fantasy XII fame on board, we have high hopes for this tantalizing tale. What games are you looking forward to? If you like what we're doing, please go ahead and click that subscribe button. It really helps us out.